All right, what's up, you guys? I'm here with the Eric Bischoff Sports Entertainment's Most Controversial Figure Three Disc Set Review, and this, in my opinion, is one of the better releases we've had in the past few years. And you know, I'm an Eric Bischoff fan, so I figured I would review this one quick. But this is uh, not the original artwork, actually. They had a very, very different um, cover where it kind of looked like the Confidential DVD, if you've ever seen that. It was kind of set up like a kind of looked like newspaper panels or comic book panels and they eventually changed it for some reason and we got this one you have Eric Bischoff there in the front you have all the you have the WCW pyro going on in the background there you have the flames and then you have your spine and this one has a runtime of seven hours and was released in 2016 so you have um, just some pretty cool artwork on the back. You have like a press conference there with a young Eric Bischoff, NWO. Gives you some of the contents, description, stuff like that. Yeah, the cover kind of looked a little more like this. A little more like, you know, the squares and rectangles. But, yeah, for some reason they changed it. I kind of do think this one looks a little bit better. So you just have some screenshots you know, from interviewing the outsiders. Woodroom meeting or creative writing meeting. And when you get in here, actually has kind of like your classic um, timeline. You have like a young Eric Bischoff, you have WCW, and then uh, Raw General Manager. So I personally really liked him as the Raw General Manager. I thought it was great. Stuff he did with Austin, really good stuff. You have the Raw Roulette, you have John Cena there, you have the cover. So the content is behind the discs. So disc one, it's all the uh, documentary. That's all that's on disc one. So you have a great documentary going on about his life, how he got into wrestling, how it's affected him. You know, it's your basic documentary. Uh, it's a lot like the Paul Heyman documentary. I don't think this one's as good as that one. But it still um, does exactly what it needed to. And in my opinion, it's a really great watch. You know, I'd say it's in the upper... Uh, kind of the upper end of the documentaries. So, very well done. And very interesting. You do learn a lot. And it takes you in the mind of, you know, who he really is. Which is awesome. Disc 2, we have stories... And then we have shows. You have the JBL show, parts one and two, with guest Eric Bischoff. And then it has Eric Bischoff's top ten most controversial moments. These stories here, you can see, if you want to pause it, you can. Just uh, really cool stuff. Honestly, you know, it it does a good job of filling its runtime Because obviously you're not going to have too many matches on here. So... You know, got to add some extra stories. And then, of course, um, kind of the JBL show. And then finally, disc three. This is when you get into really good stuff. You have a lot of promos from, you know, 87 all the way up to 2000. Let's see, 2005. But you have um, Halloween Havoc, a gift for Muhammad Ali. Jackknife Bischoff, you have the Ninja Suit Man from AWA, you have a lot of his WCW promos, Eric fires Randy Anderson, pleads for his job, once again, after being fired, um, Eric Bischoff versus Larry Zabisco, and then you have uh, him challenging Vince McMahon in a fight in 98, and you just have some other stuff here, you have him when he was named... Uh, Raw General Manager in 2002. You have Billy and Chuck's Wedding in the Skybox with Stone Cold. And then Y2J's Highlight Reel with Eric Bischoff and Stone Cold you know, on the Insurrection Paid Reel. And then, of course, you have the Trial of Eric Bischoff, which um, pretty much ended his um, original WWE run. But, you know, I definitely think he should be a Hall of Famer. You know, I think he'll go in eventually for sure. I, I think he more than deserves it. You know, he's a part of history. 
whether people want to admit that or not, he really is. So, let me know what you thought of this DVD. Let me know what you think of Eric Bischoff. And for now, this has been the DVD Freak. Peace out.